So today um, I'm going to be talking about my monthly favorites. It's the end of February. I can't believe time is going by so fast, we can say. <laughs> so I'm just going to jump in. So the first product I want to mention is the Maybelline Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser. What it does is that it doesn't really erase your pores, it just blurs them out. And I don't mind that, I do find that it does work. And also, I apply it under my eyes to blur my fine lines as well. It does work, it does a wonderful job. I also use this as a primer on my lips. And it is just completely smooth. I am wearing a matte lipstick and I don't feel it drying or sucking the, the hydration of my lips. So I really, really like this product and I do go back to it all the time. I've been using this since I, uh, since I started my videos. The next product I'm going to mention is the matte lipstick by NYX in the color Natural. This is my very, very favorite of all. I am wearing it right now on my lips. I did line my lips with a different pencil. So I really like this shade, especially in winter, in winter time. Next I want to mention another NYX product and this is the Infinite Shadow Stick in the shade Flushed. I'll swatch it for you guys right now. This is what it looks like. It's like a nice rosy pinky um, highlight. I bought two of these, uh, but and the other one's in another color, but this has been my favorite to highlight my inner corner and to highlight my brow bone. And I haven't used it as a shadow base or like just shadow, but I definitely love this as a highlight to my inner corner and my brow bone area. So totally recommend this product. It's amazing. You know what? Just talking about NYX, it's super sad that Target is closing and I actually bought this at Target and most of the products were gone. I was too late. Like, it was such a mess. Target was such a mess and I'm so sad that it's closing. But anyways, enough rambling. Going back to my products. Uh, the next thing is I've been using this for the whole month entirely ever since I purchased it and this is the Too Faced Shadow Insurance Glitter Glue. It definitely works um, for any loose pigments, uh, any sh any, per uh, any glitter pigments. I really really do love this. You don't even have to use a lot. It comes like that. You just squeeze it a little bit and you apply it. I tend to use it for my inner corner when I'm applying any loose glitter that I really want to focus on the inner corner on my lid and I I really love this product. I did mention it when when was it in the product review? Yes, I did mention it in the product review, although I didn't I didn't focus my attention to this so much, but it really does work and yeah. So now my next product is also by Too Faced and it's I think it's my favorite of all my products that I'm mentioning right now. Uh, for for Valentine's Day, well all of the products that I have were purchased by my husband. He buys them for me and I should really stop saying that I buy them <laughs> because he's the one who buys them. So th I got this on Valentine's Day. It's the Soulmates Blushing Bronzer. It's just so cute. You guys know I'm a sucker for packaging and it's called Ross and Rachel. I love Friends. I mean, I've seen a million times their show and I just love that show so much. And when, it, when I found out that it was named Ross and Rachel, oh my gosh. It's just... This is what it looks like on the inside. And it's just perfect. I really love this. I am wearing this right now. A lot of people said that this bronzer was too dark or too orangey. But I personally think it's perfect for my skin tone. I I just love this. There's another one. I just, I don't know what the name is. I just knew I wanted this one so much because it was called Russ and Rachel. Now moving on to the next one. 
This is the Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. I haven't mentioned this as a monthly favorite, but I have been using this for the past, I would say the past year. This stuff is amazing. And it's oil free, so you don't have to worry to look super shiny. I think it really does do the job in keeping the makeup in place. I've been going through tons of bottles of these and I have not changed it because I really, really do like it. I know there's another one. I haven't tried it. I will try it later on. The Chill, Chill Makeup Setting Spray. But I know that I really love this one so much. My next product is the... It's by L'Oreal. My next... Oh! My next product is by L'Oreal and it's the Revita Lift Wet Cleansing Towelettes. I use these as a makeup remover. I have tried other makeup remover wet cleansing towelettes and I have this problem with the other ones. I've tried Nivea and I've tried I think Neutrogena and I, I, I felt like those would sting my eyes so much until I found I bought these ones. These don't sting my eye unless you rub your eyes super hard with it, which I don't. Well, I did one time and I did feel it like it was burning. But if you just clean it softly, it will come off. And whatever doesn't come off, I wash my face afterwards. And, but I really, I really, really like these and I always go back to them. I do want to try other palettes, but I gotta say these have been my favorite. So my last product is the Purity Made Simple. It's a 3-in-1 cleanser for face and eyes. And this is what it does. It's uh, formulated for all skin type. It replaces your makeup remover, eye makeup remover, facial cleanser, and toner. And it deep cleans pores, it hydrates as it melts away makeup. Which is amazing. I don't use it, I, I don't like to use it so much as in just like my face is with makeup and I just wash it off. I don't like to do that because I feel like it's a lot of waste of a product. But I that's why I wipe up my makeup with my cleansing talents and then I go and hydrate my skin and cleanses my pores and it also um, removes any any leftover makeup that I had that I couldn't clean up with my wet cleansing talents. It is a little bit pricey but I do recommend it. It really does its job. So yeah, that completes my monthly favorites. And try out any of these products. If you do, let me know. If it worked for you, let me know in the comments down below. On Twitter, Instagram, or my Facebook page. Say bye, Huber. This is why I bought my kitty ears. Because I have a cat. <laughs> Say hi, Huber. You want to touch my kitty ears? <laughs> okay. I hope you guys like it. If you do, please don't forget to thumbs up at the end. Also, share this with your friends and families. And please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'll see you guys in my next video.